Hi there, I'm Corinne Hope, and I'm the Director of Marketing at Pack Up and Go. Today, we're going to walk you through our pre-trip survey. Let's get started. The pre-trip survey is how you sign up for your Pack Up and Go surprise vacation, and how our travel planning team knows your interests and travel history to plan your trip. After you sign into your account, the first step is choosing your trip type. Plane or train, road trip, outdoors road trip or staycation. This determines both your mode of transportation and influences your type of destination. For today, I will be selecting a plane or train trip. On this first plane or train trip page, you will first decide your departure date. Keep in mind that the departure date must be four weeks from the date you are signing up. The survey will default to two nights and three days. If you'd like to make your trip longer, you can change the number of nights and the return date will automatically update. Next, enter any time restrictions or preferences you have. For example, if you need to depart after a certain time or return before a certain time for work the next day or to account for the drive home, you can let us know here. You'll be able to choose if the restriction is for your departure or your return. You'll also let us know the time and any comments related to this time restriction. Then you will enter your travel history so that our travel planning team will avoid sending you to these destinations. You can also let us know any places to which you do not feel safe traveling. Please include any cities you do not want to visit in these four questions about your travel history. Otherwise, the city may be considered for your destination. You'll then let us know your travel preferences and interests, including what type of vacation experience you typically enjoy, and also what you prioritize on vacation so that we know where to focus any extra budget. Then select your interests. There are more than 30 interests to choose from, and please keep in mind that these interests are what you're interested in doing, eating, and seeing on this specific vacation. You can choose any amount of interests you want, and this helps us prepare your curated recommendations for your trip. Next, you can enter any dietary restrictions for your trip as well as what type of accommodations you prefer and you can let us know if this trip is celebrating anything special. These questions are all optional, so don't worry if you don't have an answer. Lastly, you can enter any additional information in the is there anything else we need to know question. Here, you can let us know any other details for your trip, such as specific interests, requests, or preferences, such as timing related to activities, like I'm an early riser, or I would prefer to sleep in and have a fun brunch. On the travelers page, you will enter information about each traveler joining the getaway, including their full name, make sure that it matches their ID, their gender, which is only required for plane and train trips, their email address, their phone number, as well as their current city and hometown. You'll also enter their birth date, and their height and weight, which is optional and only required for certain activities such as boating and biking. On this page, you'll also be able to add if the traveler has any mobility restrictions and if they are vaccinated against COVID-19. While you do not have to be vaccinated to travel with Pack Up and Go, this information will help our travel planning team determine your destination and recommendations. Finally, for plane trips, 
You can enter your known traveler number if you have TSA PreCheck and list all the airports from which you feel comfortable departing. Keep in mind that departing from a larger airport will lower the overall cost of your trip. The page defaults to only include one traveler, but if you want to add another traveler, you can click the Add a Travel Companion button and you can add up to 12 travelers per trip. If you want this entire experience to be a surprise for a traveler, you can enter the please do not email or contact this traveler and they will not receive any email information about this trip. If you need to remove a traveler, you can press the delete button and remove the traveler. When you're done, continue on to the next page. Next up is the rooms page where you will view how many travelers you have and confirm the number of hotel rooms you are interested in and the number of beds per room. Keep in mind that adding additional rooms will add costs to your budget option. On this page, you will also be able to add sleeping arrangement notes. This is a great place to share sleeping arrangements for children or any special bedding requests like down free pillows. Next is the budget page. The budget helps our travel planning team determine where you travel, where you stay, and what add-ons will be included in your trip. The pre-trip survey will automatically calculate your minimum and maximum budgets, which are the numbers to the left and right. Use the slider to determine the budget you feel comfortable with. Keep in mind that you'll need to budget extra on your own for meals and activities as they are not guaranteed to be included with any pack of a go trip. Lastly, on the review page, you'll be able to enter how you heard about Pack Up and Go. You'll be able to give credit to any person, friend, family, influencer, or media outlet that referred you to us. And then you'll also be able to review and confirm all of the information provided for your trip. If you see anything that's incorrect, you can use the previous button at the bottom of the page. The last step for the payment page is entering your emergency contact information. And the mailing address for your envelope. You will also agree to travel to the mystery destination with an open mind. On the payment page, you'll be able to decide if you want to add peace of mind refund assurance. This optional add-on provides added flexibility and guaranteed refunds if you need to change or cancel your trip. You'll also be able to enter any promo codes or gift cards that you have. Then finally, you'll decide if you want to pay with PayPal, credit card, or a firm. Enter your information, and that's it. We hope this video clears up any questions you may have while filling out our pre-trip survey. If you have any questions, we are always here to help. And please feel free to email, comment, or give us a call. Thanks so much for tuning in, and be sure to like, subscribe, and let us know what else you'd like to see from Pack Up and Go.